Hi all, welcome back. Today I have a vintage haul and try on. So these are things that I've bought, I'd say over the last few weeks, definitely, last couple of months. And I bought the odd thing that I just haven't shown because I've forgotten, basically. <laughs> so my name's Sam. Um, my channel is just a lifestyle channel. Um, I talk about how I've lost £65 and what I'm doing to keep it off. Um, being 53 and being really into fashion, really into staying at sustainable fashion. So you'll see a lot of charity shop hauls and vintage hauls here. Um, how I dress my wardrobe. I've got a lot of clothes. <laughs> um, a lot of them I've sold and given to charity because I've lost, um, just in the last sort of like couple of months, I've lost just over a stone and um, all my clothes are too big. And actually a couple of these things I've bought, I don't know why, but I'm still in the mode of getting, my head's still ordering size 14 or buying size 14. And with vintage, you don't know until you get it. So let's start with this lovely, I wanted a cami, a little ivory cami. And this is a jewels cami and this was two pounds. Um, it's a, sorry, it's got a double layer underneath so I don't have to, you know, sometimes you get a cami, you have to wear a vest and I'm like, I don't want to do that. I don't want a double layer. It's got this really pretty sort of like contrasting red on the little splits. And yeah, I got it in a size 14. Probably could have got down size maybe. Um, nice straps on the back, very pretty, lovely material. It does crease. So that's that was two pounds, size 14. Then I got this little cotton boho top by Little Buddha, and this was four pounds. And um, these are very expensive actually, I just didn't realize, but I just loved it. I love the color there, that sage is one of my favorite colors. It's basically the same color as my surroundings. And it's just beautifully made. And that is a medium, and that's by the brand Little Buddha. So I'm just going to pop these here because they'll get creased. So next I've got this beautiful button down shirt. It's brand new, never brand new without tags, but it was still in the bag. Maybe it got worn once and it's a lovely fitted white blouse, cotton. It's got a lovely little detail of the B for Bowden on there. And this was only four pounds. So I got it in a size 14. I don't know what size I am really at the moment. I think it could go, like I said, between a 10, 12 and a 14. Who knows these days? But yeah, I really love that. Brand new and it's fitted and um, tailored beautifully. Four pounds. I mean, you can't go wrong, can you? Then I got this quite a while ago. But it, was, it wasn't quite summer. And this was two pounds and it's a next. Next beach. Gosh, that's... I'm going to take this off, but I just wanted to show you. So that's the next beach, 12. And it's just proper... I don't know, It's you can wear it bardo, it's like a um, sort of cheesecloth, it's got a split up one side and it's a midi, so it's not a really long one and um, what's this called? Sheared, yes that's it. And that was only £2, so that was a really good buy. Then you have seen me try this one on, this is how long I've had these and not really done a proper haul have I? But um, I've only tried it on, I haven't told, told you about it. So the dress I'm wearing but it's showing my bra, is from Next. I bought it a couple of years ago in the sale and it's, I love it. It's very long, it's got splits at the side. So the back is open and um, they had another one at the time that was yellows and mauves, but it didn't sort of suit me. I don't know why, I should have bought it, but it might suit me now, but who knows. Anyway, but they also then had a pink and red polka dot. My hair's sticking out of stuff. That's the only thing about having that bit hair pokes out the side of the glasses that's why I cut a little bit off the other week anyway and so I managed to get it for I'm going to say five pounds this was in from Vinted and this is size 12 and I just absolutely love it so I've worn this many times I love that colour I love that bright pink and bright red together so it, it has a bit down the front you can see but where it's stretched out, it, the same as this one, it doesn't, I like a sweetheart neckline, you know what I mean? It's very flattering. So all I've done is just ruched that and then sewn it so it's got that, so it does go like that rather than straight across. Um, it just gives it a bit of something extra and it's really, really, I just love it. There you go, what can I say? Five pounds. Um, then I got this. I wanted a little white, it's more of a cream, sort of ivory, um, 
little denim jacket for ages. This was £12. Nearly new. She said she tried it on. And you can tell. You can tell. Um, red herring, size 12. Love it. I do like red herring. They do some nice stuff. Very good quality. It's good quality denim. Quite quite thick, actually. I wouldn't want to wear it in this weather. It's far too hot. Then I've got my favourite thing that I've worn time and time again, which you haven't seen, and it is this gorgeous smock style um, dress from, I think it's two. Now this is a size 14 too, because I didn't, I saw it, I fell in love and I wanted it, I didn't care if it was a size 14. I don't, it doesn't matter to me. I, sometimes I think, oh, well, I'll just get it. Oh, I don't want to, I don't want to try it on because I'm not that size anymore. Just do it. You know, it doesn't matter, does it? And sometimes when they're worn, they shrink anyway, once they've been washed. But it's got a sheer back, lovely bell sleeves. It's a beautiful linen blend. Just lovely. And actually, even though it creases, oh, it's got an underskirt as well. Linen, linen, yeah, it says linen, cotton. Um, even though it creases, it doesn't really matter. It's that sort of linen's okay to have that, isn't it? Like the small ones, but I love it. Everybody asked me where I got it from. And in fact, if you go on Vinted now, I believe there's one for, um, sorry, I got this for seven pounds. And I believe there was one a couple of weeks ago um, going for sort of like eight pounds. And it's worth it if you're gonna wear it all the time. It's, oh. Yes, so my this is my favourite. Yes, love it. Sometimes a contrast with dark hair and that, uh, with a little, with a little page boy haircut, a little pixie cut, and a flouncy dress can sometimes look quite nice. Shoes. <laughs> I bought these very cute little vintage style Mary Jane shoes for I don't know why, but they were. Um, well, I've got it written down, £3.50 from Next. Only worn once, and I can see that, but they have got a scuff on the heel. But to tell the truth, I could probably do something with that or take it to the... Well, I won't take it to anyone. No one's going to see it. No one's going to see it. So I might just file it down a little bit and put some pink, which I've got nail varnish on there, a couple of coats. But apart from that, they are lovely. Perfect little kitten heels. Like I say, they've only been worn to a wedding that's what people do but i just thought i love them <laughs> i'll never probably wear them but for that price and then a brand new pair of these from next oh no sorry m s m s those were next soul reviver so they're the comfy ones and then these ones were eight pounds brand new bright pink oh look at them very 70s 60s i really love them and as you can see, never been worn. So m and they, they would have been, they would have definitely been over 25 pounds, something like that. They wouldn't have been cheaper than 20 quid, would they? So did a real good bargain. Last but not least is this bag. So this bag is exactly the same as a bag I had about 12 years ago when my sister got married. And um, I bought it for, I, I had a really lovely dress and just uh, and I needed a cream bag and as somebody that absolutely oh, that absolutely loves anything with skulls on a little bit sort of like edgy a little bit this has got a beautiful crystal skull on it's from Miss Selfridge and I think I paid 18 pounds so that was going back some it'd probably be 28 30 pounds these days but I let my children my daughters borrow it and they ruined it basically <laughs> they ruined it and i moaned and moaned and i still moaned that i said i was who's got my skull bag old oh, moment was rubbish i threw it away they got lipstick eyeliner scuffs lost a load of the jewels on it and then my daughter went on to vinted and she found one within five minutes there it is it's like an envelope so it's quite a quite a, you can see it's quite a nice size and it's got a an attached chain silver chain which i think goes really nicely or you can get a cream chain you can get anything this color so i don't think it's leather but it's very soft inside you've got your your thing and it's very nice no it's only been used a couple of times you know it, you can tell because anything that's white you use it once and it's ruined isn't it so especially inside when it's material so that is that so shall i try some things on and let you see how it looks 
hopefully I found a place to put my camera where you can see all of me. So this is the pink dress and you saw it before when I did my collaboration with Busy Bee Marie but I, but I bought these um, sandals at the same time. That's going to rub my toe. You know when you know. So I'm going to have to be careful there. Um, but they are lovely. They're the perfect pink so they go lovely together. I'll come forward a little bit there. That's the shoes. And hopefully, yes, you can see me, even though it's probably going to cut my head off. So this is the dress. It's the same as the other one. It feels a little bit loose for this one. Maybe that one's a 10. I don't know. Um, but yes, that's the next dress that I've got from Vinted that I have worn to death. Um, I'm not so sure about this one. If I'm wearing like full uh, shearing, I find my boobs are too big. You know, it's not fitted. All I'm seeing is, is that. But this is the two pound dress. I'm not sure. It's a little bit, I don't know. It's, I, feel, I feel a little bit exposed. You can probably see my bra at the back. Um, it's more, well, it says beach wear, so it's possibly just a beach cover up. Um, it's a little bit, it's not too tight. It just feels a bit tight, you know? It's got pockets though, so it does redeem itself. I'm gonna walk back, sorry, you probably can't see. Uh, yeah, so yeah, it's got the pockets, which are very nice. Um, but I thought I'd just wear it with my slides that I got. I did, I think I showed you these ones, really nice. They were from Vinted too, very comfortable. But look what this jacket does. You see what I mean? It's just, it just gives it that little bit of, hmm. So I love this jacket, I've worn it quite a few times. But I'm not, I probably wear the dress around the house and in the garden, but I don't think it's much of a going out dress. Um, but yeah. There we go. That's and I thought I'd put the jacket on as well. Gosh, it's hot, too hot to wear a jacket. But yeah, I'm not as keen on this dress. Obviously, I like a longer one. So this is the TU dress that I bought. Um, I love it. It's got plenty of room, but I did get a size 14. It's just this doesn't have pockets, but it's, it does no bad thing, you know. I wore this out, and, and even people of my family and everyone said, "Oh, where'd you get your dress?" And so. Um, people on Instagram because I put a photograph on Instagram where you get dressed so it really is obviously something quite beautiful I do you know I think I might have seen some this style but in a different pattern anyway this is that lovely two dress anyway with these lovely sandals that were from next last year I'll show you them close up oh I hope they're not dirty anyway that's that's what they look like they're a rose gold and they're so comfortable. And I believe I got these for about, I don't know, 10, 12 pound. Next, sorry, you can't see me, but next are brilliant for that. Their sales are always really good. Their clearance sales, you know, the beautiful things I've got that were 48 pounds, down to 10 pounds, down to eight pounds. It's always worth looking on there. That's where I would go and get my clothes from if I was getting them from next. So here's that little button down Bowden shirt. I love it, look at that, gorgeous. So I've just got it on with a pair of white rocket dog slides that have got rainbows and stars all over them. And, uh, shut that door. and my little bargain M&S jeans that I got from Oxfam for a couple of quid. I must go there again, actually. I'm going to Chippenham tomorrow, so I might have a little look in Oxfam. In fact, they might still have my scarf. So it's, it's fitted. I'm very happy with it and the good thing is it fits down the boot. I'm gonna, I don't need to do that because I quite like a big collar, sorry, I quite like a big collar there. So yeah, I'm really happy with it. So this is the Jules top. It is too big really, I could have got, you know, well I couldn't have got a smaller size because they didn't have a smaller size. So this is a 14 and it's, it's, it's well, miles too big. But it's not too, too big. It looks okay. I think it looks okay because it's got the, um, what's it called? The V-neck. Anyway, I'm just going to do a little bit of tucking. I know we don't tuck many things in this life anymore. I don't know if it's still in fashion to do the tuck. Nobody wants anything tucked in in the summer. Anyway, so I've tucked it in a little bit. Uh, it's still a bit, isn't it? And I sort of wanted something to go underneath the blazer. So, there we are. Now, if I was to wear this and not take, that's what I wanted it for, but it seems like far too much material, really. 
but that is the sort of look I'm going for, for really, maybe not with these. Let's try them with different slides. Because those ones are a bit, a bit childish, but I like a bit of childish. Anyway, so, oh actually, how, what do you think? I think, now that I've put it in, I've tucked it, I'd probably do it a bit better. I've just shoved it down there at the moment, but I think that looks quite nice, doesn't it? So just tuck it right in. Pull this side bits down. I can't see a thing what I'm doing. And I think that actually, that works, doesn't it? I think that, yeah, I think that works. God, I'm hot. That's the thing, isn't it? Doing these try-ons in this weather. So that's quite good. These are... These have got plenty of room and I don't really want to, I'd, I'd love to have a flat tummy. We all would, but then, you know. So that, I think that looks quite nice together. Quite sort of classy, isn't it? I quite like that. I, don't, I know I'm very colourful and a bit way out with my clothes, but sometimes I do like to look a little bit classy, you know. So there you go. That's that little boat on top. But then it, I suppose it looks so, I don't know. That's a lot of material to be playing with and it's, massive so i don't i don't know what do you think should i just keep it and wear it for for four quid or should i sell it on i could do with i could just do with a, a smaller size or even two sizes smaller and then this really cute little boho booty top i wore it to work the other day and everyone loved it it's just so cool to wear you know it's just cotton that beautiful bit of heavy embroidery isn't too too heavy it's quite light so i just love it i love the colors it's very natural looking very easy to wear and I just really really love it it looks quite nice with this doesn't it really so that is that oh I'm worn out now so those was that was my collective vintage um shop now I did order oh the most gorgeous long crochet um cardigan but it's not it's gone to basically in post who are a delivery service and I've used them before and the thing that I had by in post was lost and this was lost, unfortunately. So it was a beautiful long crochet um, cardigan, long sleeve, but very um, open, lacy. And I really wanted that. But unfortunately, it got picked up and it's never been seen since. And that was a few weeks it ago. It might turn up, but you never know. But they, you know, they give them so much time and then they give you back the money back and what, and the person that sold it, they get the money that they would have got. So that's quite good. That, I mean, vintage, vintage are pretty good for doing that. So those were my outfits. Have I got anything? Oh, a little pair of yellow shoes coming because I'd sold something. So I'm selling slowly. I had a mass sale where I sold loads and then it stops again. But I think it's just the way of it, isn't it? Um, yeah, so what did you think? I mean, the only thing was the um, this top's too big, which is such a shame. But when I saw it, when I ordered it but you don't know because some things I think I think I really need to you know just be aware that I can have a 12 or a 10 with Bowden depending on what it is whereas um, my mum might like this I'll see if it fits her. so I'm going to look for some this thing again in a smaller size maybe one or two size smaller probably just the one just to be on the safe side um, because even tucked in there's too much material isn't there hanging out um, the little the red dress the dark red dress with the polka dots i feel is too small even though it's size 12 and um but it's just it's just too tight all over i just don't don't feel comfortable in it so i might see if my sister might want that um or sell it on or give it to charity you know you know how it goes sell it on or give it to charity what's two quid you know it's, it's either give it to a good cause or wash your windows with it so that is my haul and i said it again haven't i <laughs> um I have got um, a day out tomorrow. I'm not doing anything Sunday, and um, I was going to. I said I'm I'm going to the Pride um, walk and big concert, and basically the whole day is a, a Pride festival in a town next to me called uh, Chippenham, and I'm going there tomorrow. I hope it's not going to be too hot because I'm wearing a wig, but I know there is some drag going on, and if they can wear wigs, I will stand in solidarity. <laughs> <laughs> solidarity with the wig wearers so um, I've got a big pink wig and I might I'll do that in the morning because I want to show you what I'm wearing um, I've got a few little different ideas so I might try I might if I've got time put them all on and show you and then afterwards I'll show you what I decide on wearing <laughs> thank you so much for coming 
But if you like the content, please like and subscribe. I've got a, I, I love my little community here and I know there's a lot of us midlife ladies really enjoying having YouTube channels. We should have done it earlier, shouldn't we? But there you go. You don't know until you try, do you? So lovely to be back and um, hopefully I'm on a roll now. Bye bye.